All right, hello everyone. My name is Christian and I'm from DAT, um, Dimensions Agri Technologies from Norway. We have developed a sensor system that basically uh, takes pictures of a wheat field in green on green environments like we have around us now. And we shut off sections where there is no need to spray. If there is no weeds, there's no need to spray. We have operated this system in Norwegian and Scandinavian uh, fields for uh, seven, eight seasons now. And we have installed the first system ever in the Baltic countries here in Lithuania together with our partner for distribution Luxera. We just finished the first uh, samples now and um, uh, quite successfully seeing that everything works on this Amazon Pantera um, sprayer. All right, so the system is used in small cereals, wheats, oats, rye and barley and we're moving to other crops as we go but managing this green on green um, sea and spray in a small cereal is extremely challenging because of the unstructured uh, environment. So we're very proud that we're managing to do that. And the main benefits obviously is we reduce the amount of herbicides that the farmer use. In 2022, the average was 40%. Where we don't spray, we typically measure an increased yield of anywhere from two to nine, 10%, uh, depending on the chem chemicals and the environments uh, around. You avoid the, the development of resistant weeds. Uh, it's easier in logistics because you don't have to refill the tanks so often. And we collect um, maps, digital maps of weed heat maps so that you basically, the farmer will know after where is my trouble, trouble spots or my weed heat spots and where am I completely weed free to know um, how to tackle that also for the next season. That's the main, um, main benefits. So what's unique about the DAT system is that we apply a, a patch spraying uh, strategy where we take samples and determine what's going on around the picture. So the, these cameras are, are very high resolution, um, take very high resolution images around 50, 50 centimeters above the uh, crops, uh, two pictures per second. Then we have very strong blitzes, making sure that we have very clear pictures day and night, so the spray can be used day and night. And we also have a little fan that sucks in air and blows air over the lens to make sure the lens is always clean and dust free. And we space these sensors three, four, five uh, meters uh, away from each other. And we use um, uh, agronomic statistics to basically determine whether we should s switch on a section or not. All right, so um, the cool thing also about the DAT is that we are retrofit. We can come and uh, put our sensors on any kind of sprayer as long as it's isobus. And this is a fantastic Amazon Pantera, uh, self-propelled obviously, uh, where we have installed and we have basically, not if you can see the central unit in the, in the back where we have pulled the uh, power cables and isobus connection or the canvas cables directly into the screen here, where we have very easy um, operations, simple Simply, the, the farmer will, will turn on his sprayer and then decide to switch on or off the, the DAT system. And then he, he, he or she will be able to follow the monitors. Um, currently taking pictures now and we can see how sensors one, sensor one is reading uh, quite heavy weed pressure. Switch on and off and uh, the map is generated. Um, when you finish a session, then we, we generate the map. Okay, so we had a great time um, mounting the system. The first one in Lithuania, our, our first foot in the door, um, together with the technical team from Luxera, Lithuania. We also had great uh, assistance from SV Technica here in Lithuania, who is a um, distributor of the Amazon uh, sprayers. And together with the technical resources from DAT, we did this uh, complete installation in about one day. So, and everything is working now technically, and um, yeah, we're, we're really happy. So thank you everyone for the collaboration and your help.